Are there any taxis around here? I need to find myself a travel guide. Did I hear you say travel guide? I can teach you all about India and its culture. India is the seventh largest nation in the world and is located in South Asia. Indian history starts with the birth of the Indus River Valley Civilization. Once that civilization collapsed, the Mughals took over India. The British took over the Mughal Empire in 1858, and after many decades of struggle, India gained its independence with Gandhi, who led India to freedom. Can you tell me anything about Indian music? So, Bollywood is the main genre of music in India, and Shreya Goshal and Arjit Singh are some of the popular artists. Speaking of music, let's go to the concert happening, like, there. Hindi is one of two official languages of India, the other being English. Hindi is spoken by around 500 million people and is the third most spoken language in the world. Can you teach me any words? Sure, so Namaste means both hello and goodbye, and Apkizeho means how are you. Can you tell me anything about popular culture in India? Yeah, so Bollywood is the biggest film industry in India. Some famous actors include Shah Rukh Khan, Tiger Shroff, Priyanka Chopra, Alia Bhatt, and Hrithik Roshan. Also, India has a really big cricket fan base even though field hockey is its national sport. The Indian cricket team has won both the Cricket World Cup and the ICC Champions Trophy twice. India is home to the largest cricket stadium in the world, the Sardar Patel Stadium in Ahmedabad, India. What are those people eating over there? That's a masala dosa. Masala dosa is a South Indian dish, which is like a crepe filled with spicy potatoes. Those people over there seem to be eating something different. What are they eating? That's palak paneer and naan. Palak paneer and naan are both North Indian foods. Palak paneer is a curried dish made from spinach and unaged cottage cheese, and naan is like a soft flatbread. is a type of Indian folk art that reflects Indian culture. Are there any instruments unique to India or its folk culture? Yeah, there's the sitar and the veena. Actually, one of the Indian goddesses has a veena. Is Hinduism the only religion in India? No, the top three are Hinduism, Jainism, and Islam. Hey, why is all that trash on the ground? Um, India is known for not having the best living conditions and the climate makes it worse. India has a lot of litter on its streets. There are many issues surrounding the environmental topics of India. Its most pressing environmental issues are water shortage, land damage, and air and water pollution. On the topic of India's environment, India has ridiculously hot climates. It also has hot and cold deserts, highlands, forests, and more. Ironically, this is our last stop in India. Mumbai, the gateway of India. The gateway of India was built to commemorate the arrival of King George V and his wife Queen Mary in 1911. It's one of India's most popular tourist destinations. Wow, that is so beautiful. Okay, so I'm gonna go, but if you have extra time in India, you can visit the Taj Mahal in Agra and the Red Fort in Delhi, which are popular tourist destinations. The Taj Mahal is one of the seven wonders of the world. It was built by a Mughal emperor named Shah Jahan as a mausoleum for his wife. The Red Fort is a massive palace that was also built by Shah Jahan when he shifted his capital from Agra to Delhi. Thank you so much for teaching me about India's culture.